What is going on guys and welcome back to the Versatorious Gaming Channel. Today we are back on Latrine's profile. We're not on Midnight's profile, we are on Latrine's profile. And as you can see, we are still in the dark woods. Latrine, having some time away from the clan at the moment, just to regather her thoughts, decide whether she wants to leave to start her own clan, whether she wants to just leave and die peacefully on her own. Heartbroken, but peacefully. Or whether... She has decided to return. Now, today's episode is basically going to be us and Latrine. There is going to be no other people online. I'm not going to message Overlord. I'm not going to message Fousey. I'm not going to be with Scold. This is purely us, you, me, and Latrine. That is it. That is all that is going to be about today. So, we are in the dark woods. And, yeah, we're just going to basically see how this session plays out as a lone bird. Maybe we'll make our way up towards Hot Springs, see if we can see any of them. Obviously, Latrine's got a fend for herself. Now she hasn't got the protection of the clan. And that means things are a lot more dangerous for our young heroine. Just to be incredibly careful. Obviously, being a lone bird, she's an easy target for many different species of carnival and while she's fast she is not the fastest dinon in the world so let's get some food down us and then we'll go explore see if we can find some some uh Oh, okay. I only needed one piece from that. Well, that was a bit of a kill. Waste of a kill, but either way. So, looking at the map, where should we go? I'm thinking we're going to head across this way. I'm going to come down here. And I think that is a nice way to go. We're going to go around the outside of the map. So this, if I remember correctly, is salt water. It is. So we need to make it across to the other side. And obviously, Latrine is not the best swimmer but she sees a little opening here and she's gonna go for it and she doesn't quite make it all the way across but she's not far off a little bit of a shake get the water off and we carry on on our way I swear I keep hearing something behind me now, I've got to be very careful because I don't want to accidentally have Latrine get killed off here so I have got to be very careful that uh, I don't use too much stamina and that I can get away if need be. You know what I mean? Like, we don't want to lose Latrine. Take a drink from the small one. I don't see anything around us. Is that a creature in the middle there, or is is that a corpse or something? I feel like that's a corpse, maybe. Imagine if this is actually like it is a corpse. I didn't realise there were bones in a corpse here. We are scavengers, so we'll scavenge a bit of this. I can't see us being able to take down our own. Apart from the, the AI camps, I can't see us taking down our own food. We're not going to be able to PvP anyone or anything like that, let's be honest. We are just one Danon. We're not, uh, we're not multiple Danons. And one Danon cannot defeat most big breads. Or even big herbivores for that matter. So if we, unless we see a camp tool or a juvenile or a baby or something like that, there's not a lot that Latrine's going to be able to do. Oh, didn't take no damage there, which is good. I wonder.
picking up a lily because we know who that reminds Latrine of. And if you don't know who that reminds Latrine of, you haven't watched the other episodes and you should go back and watch them. Yeah, I have got to be careful not to run into any other clan members. Obviously, that will ruin some of the roleplay aspect of this, so... Maybe I should have gone onto the other server while uh, I did this, but I thought, nah. I like the idea that we might get seen by the clan. Because it means if we do get seen by the clan, then we can do a little bit of a roleplay element. But she's not quite ready to go back yet. But also, at the same time, it might be interesting if we try and give this to Lily. We actually try and get this to Lily. Without the rest of the clan spotting us. So at least Lily knows we're okay. It's just, it would just be unfortunate that... Uh, it would just be unfortunate for Aegis. That uh, we... We, we, I don't think we can see Aegis. We can't see Aegis because we'll stay. Yeah, we'll go up this way. We'll go around the... the is that the burn forest, is it? Yeah, we'll go around the... Well, no, this is the burn forest. I think I'm not quite sure what this is. But we'll go that way anyway. But yeah, so we're going to try and avoid Aegis, but try and get this to Lily. I think that's the plan of action. Or at least leave it in a place where Lily might... Lily will see it. I am shocked that I have not seen another dino of any species just yet. I know I'm not sticking around in one place very long, but even so... Now... Should we go around this way or go around this way? I think we go this way. Uh, no, sorry. Let's go this way. By going this way, it'll allow us to get up here. I don't know whether we can run over this, but we're going to try. Yeah, we're not going to be able to get very far on this. This, is, I believe, is lava. Or what was lava. But we can cut quite a bit of our journey out by just going over it like that. That was nearly into a tree. That was into a log. So burned forest because of the molten lava. Oh, we're dancing. We're dancing. No, we're not. We're stuck. My lord. Right. Hunter's thicket. So we are getting very close now to... I basically, I'm just going to terrorise the clan slightly, I think. It's daytime, so I don't really want to be over there in daytime. I'd rather be over there in the da in the night. Because if we get... Like, in the day, we're more likely to be seen. At night, we're not. And I have to be incredibly careful doing this. I can't risk being seen. It's not fair on... Me or the clan members to get seen at this point because it ruins it ruins the roleplay it ruins the story. It's happening, but I literally the mission on this episode is purely to give Lily this without with either Lily seeing me, but nobody else seeing me, or Lily not seeing me. So I have to be incredibly careful. Right, so there's obviously where they, they all hang out. So they're awake. That's not good. I'm not sure quite who's down here. Okay, there's Lily. There's Nyx. There's Griffin. Is that... Is that Mercurius? Is Mercurius there? That looks, that looks like Mercurius. Who's that in the background over there? Is that Aegis? Is 
There's Mercurius. There's Griffin. There's Lily. I've just said... Oh, it is Agus! Damn. That's unfortunate with both of them there. I just need Lily. I don't need the others. Nyx is asleep. Agus is asleep. Griffin is asleep. I think. Or, or Akrivi. Um, Mercurius, sorry. Mercurius. I need whatever this one is to be asleep. This, this is Griffin. This is Griffin. He's got, he, Griffin does this weird thing where he goes backwards and forwards and he's doing it now. Can I do it while they were all there? Can I do it? Oh, what? Is it despawned already? Oh, what? I wonder. We we lost a lily. But there's a flower here, look. Is there a way we can get this flower to lily? Problem is, Aegis comes up here quite often, so... We've got to watch for Aegis. I suppose it doesn't matter whether it's Lily or Aegis. I think they've seen me. I think they've seen me. I'd be very surprised if they haven't. Now, I don't know whether they saw me or not. There we go. I think we were successful. I'm not 100%. I'm going to... I assume that flower fell. And if in the clan chat, a picture of Lily comes up with the flower... Then there's a very good if that if, if if a picture comes up in the clan screenshots of Lily with that flower, our mission has been successful. Lily is reminded that Latrine is still alive. She is not finished yet. You are using stamina. What have you seen that's made you run the other way? Oh, is that... That's two T-Rexes, isn't it? That's two T-Rexes. They're going straight in. Are they T-Rexes? No, they're not. I don't know what they are. I'm useless with what are the... I see you sneaking up on me, Pinko. Pick no, rather. I haven't managed to get either of them, and I now need to run myself because there's a Pickno who literally walked up beside me. My lord. Them things are fast as well. I want to see what happens with this Rex and Lamb. 
We have a pick no between us. Okay, come on, come on. You are Latrine. One of the dominant daughters of the Northern Lights clan. You do not die to no, oh, to no pick no. There you go. Nice and clean back up top, right. They're still chasing it. Way off in the distance over there, look, you can see it. Pick nose going that way, so we can carry on going this way. The one T the T Rexes are T Rexes are backing off, are they? Are they backing off? Are they losing this battle? They're still following. Still following. There's something behind me, so I'm, I'm a little nervous. They are still following it. That's that pink. No, that is. Doing the collecting. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Aggression. Aggression coming out then. Oh, listen to this. My lord, I don't want to get I don't want to get caught here. Wait, did they beat the T-Rex? Did they beat them? Surely not. Yo, they bad. The Rex is going. Oh, they in the, they in the bush. They must have battered one of them. Re oh, he's gone to sleep as well. They must have battered him really bad. I don't want to get any closer, but we can sort of look in like this, maybe. Ouch! That is unfortunate. Oh, there's another fight going on. Oh. Entertainment for the masses on the train's adventures. Oh, he is in trouble. He is in trouble. He is dead. There is no way he survives this, surely. Oh, my lord. Are they coming this way? No. Yo, he jumped a rock. That's got to be a mech tree. Oh, there's two of them. They're back. Three of them? Surely the Pikno knows that that's end the end of his food now. I don't want to be seen by the, the Pikno. Surely he knows that's the end of his food now. They're chase, They're running. And shouting. They're running and shouting. Oh, they are chasing. They are. Oh, this is a very dangerous place for Latrine to be. Oh, they are much faster than me. He's too called. That was a two call. Or a four call, I think. They're still looking for him. They can't switch targets onto whatever that is. Oh my. Let's go up here. Let's go up here. Yeah, you soon took tail and run, didn't you? Okay. You soon took tail and ran, didn't you? Not so big when he had his friend. <laughs> <laughs> he 
He jumped a rock. Oh, they were mobbing. Because them two are leaving without that one now. I can hear, a, like, a dine on around me somewhere. At least it feels like that. I think I think they're caught in. Let's go into Ansel and let's have a look at... Let's have a good look, see what they're doing. Are they going into a fight or are they going into court in? I think there's... I'm not really sure. And there's Rexy. And that... Look like a camp toe. Lucky for it, I am not hungry. Don't think about it. Walk straight past. Walk straight past. I can still see all oh, this. One there, one there. Even he was too scared to go with that. He's going back on there. I think he's going back to look for him. But he can't. He's on timer. So, he's patrolling his territory. He was in his territory and he didn't even defend it. You think I can't see you? I'll be prepared to go. Three, two, one. Go. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. Thank you for letting me through. <laughs> oh, lordy. Right. Take a quick drink. Well then, that was eventful, and I think that is probably going to end the video as well. If you have enjoyed it, then please drop a like, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and hopefully, next time we see Latrine, she will be making her way back home. I will see you all very soon.